right, gang, so here we are. It's almost 12.30, which is kickoff time for Spurs. And because of the way they do things and the way that my uh, satellite is set up, I don't get satellite in the garage. I get local channels and streaming. And USA, who currently has the pregame coverage, uh, is only available on satellite. So I don't get the pregame in the garage. So I, I could have stayed in the house watch the pregame and come running out here and try to change it over before the game actually started. That's just kind of a pain in the ass when you want to get set up. So anyway, I've got game game on, channel four on, starts in about two minutes. Um, super impressive the way the Brits are handling the, the uh, passing of the Queen when it comes to football. Uh, Spurs Stadium was silent during the tribute. Ledley King, a club legend, carried out a wreath to midfield. They do they do a good job with those kind of historical things. So the big news so far, and we'll find out more later, I'm sure, and see how the how it works out. But uh, Sun Young Min, Young Min Sun, depending on who you ask, is uh, on the bench, starting the game on the bench. First time in quite a while Sonny's not been a starter for us, but he's having a bit of a down spell and we can't afford that. So, uh, as disappointing as it is and unfortunate for him, it's football. You gotta, you gotta win. You gotta score. You gotta produce. So we're we've mixed up our lineup a little bit. We did not look good midweek, and there's four changes from that team to this team. Uh, we'll see how it goes. So. Um, I'm going to watch the match and get some exercise in, and uh, I'm sure I'll holler at you again later. All right, so uh, I'm done with my workout. It took me a little longer because I had a little blood sugar issue. I knew it was coming. That's so stupid. I hate it. But it is what it is. So I'm done with my cardio. I'm done with some resistance training. Be sure to uh, keep your eye on shorts because I'll put my uh, weightlifting there today. Uh, still not happy with the issues going on in my shoulder. I have no idea what exactly it is. There's no telling. Uh, but the strength is significantly diminished. Um, highly frustrating. I got enough uh, going against me in other areas to have this shoulder bothering me so much. Uh, but it is what it is. So uh, I went in a little while ago. Uh, I had to go in the use the bathroom. And uh, so I gave my father a heads up. Um, I bought for him at the grocery store, knowing that he was going to be the only one getting a, a, a eaten, a cooked meal this evening. So I bought two of his favorites, two of his favorite things: Stouffer's French uh, French bread pizza and uh, Stouffer's meaty lasagna. He loves them both. I've already got a tomato cucumber salad made. He loves that too thought, perfect, I'll pop one in the oven and be done with feeding him for this evening. And uh, so I went in, I used the bathroom on, the way, on my way out. I said, you got, a, you got a choice for dinner. I gave him his two options. And then I got this. Chrissy, you know what I want? The, uh, I, I really want the, the Little Caesars fancy pepperoni. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, what? You want Little Caesar's fancy pepperoni for dinner. Those weren't one of the two options I just gave. Um, so you either want me to pay a ridiculous delivery fee or I go pick it up for you when there's food in the freezer that no one else is going to eat. This is one of those times where it's really hard to differentiate. Is this the same asshole Walt that I've known my entire life? Or is this the, uh, I've had multiple strokes and my brain's not working quite right Walt? And you know what? The annoyance is the same either way. His alma mater's on TV playing an, uh, an SEC opponent and uh, he's watching Notre Dame, the team that he hates. There's frustration there too. That 
That is the stroke brain damage wall for sure. So I guess I'm gonna wrap things up here and watch a little more of the Penn State game before I go to the Caesars for the last dinner. Oh boy. If I thought I was going to heaven, I'd ask for an extra reward for dealing with this asshole for 50 plus years. I'm not going to hell either. I'm living in it. It's called taking care of an asshole. Oh, now I'm just venting to you. Spurs won. Great game. Love it. Alright, that's all for now. See ya. Alright, so uh, the pizza has been delivered. Of course, I had to have a piece. Uh, in spite of the fact that it was Little Caesars, it wasn't terrible. And again, I'm kind of so pizza obsessed, as you may have seen on my Instagram stories, that um, I am a firm believer that, that it's really, really, really hard to make a bad pizza. So I used to say there was no such thing as a bad pizza, but there is. <clears throat> one with pineapple on it comes to mind, or one with mushrooms on it. I know. Hot take, right? I don't like mushrooms. Anyway, um, so I've finished my workout and just uh, decided I was going to sit out here in the garage and watch football. I don't have to listen to uh, anybody cough. I don't have to be asked um, repetitive questions. And um, I can sit out here and drink some beers and chill out for a while. Good living. Living my best life, I think, is the, the uh, ideal that is espoused in this situation. So, Penn State won. It makes me happy. Uh, I don't give a shit about many of the games that are left to be played, but I'll, I'll watch some nonetheless. And then I will uh, take my edible, my gummy, my THC, HHC Delta 9... 10 milligram whatevers and uh, get a good night's sleep and watch Premier League games I don't give a shit about either. Wait a minute. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Anyway, we'll talk more about that tomorrow. So anyway, I think I'm done for the day. Just wanted to check back in and give you a heads up that I'm out. So, see you tomorrow.